encapsulated ingredients protects an ingredient from its environment until release or interaction is desired. That can be accomplished in a variety of ways, starting actually with the starting core material. IFP is a line of standard off-the-shelf prime cap ingredients, and it's a good starting point for somebody to do their evaluations, but the number of layers, the melt point of the coating, the uh, size of the particle may not be ideal for somebody's conditions. So what we can do is we can modify the size of the particle uh, that we start with. In other words, you can start with a fine powder or you can start with a granular material. That's going to manipulate your surface area of your finished product as well as your active when it does release. We can modify the number of layers of coating. We can modify the coating material. Choosing the right coating material is going to give you the ability to uh, select either a water soluble or a hot melt based on temperature release. We can also manipulate the layers of coating to create something that's going to fracture. In other words, if chewing is the release or physical mixing, we can make a coated material that's going to either survive or not survive physical mixing, fracture, chewing. So we can manipulate the survival properties as well as the release properties by manipulating everything from the particle size to the choice of coating materials to how many individual layers of coating material we apply.